And what's up there YouTube, Stampede Valkyrie coming back at you again. My first official video of 2023. So greetings to all, a belated Happy New Year. Uh, kind of chilly, but actually kind of nice day here in February. A little before the uh, Valentine's Day. And what I'm looking at here is a bar that my buddy has had probably for a considerable amount of time. And he's finally getting off his butt and he's telling me what he wants to do. So I'm looking at a bar, Red Blue. It's the only thing I know is an Aerodynic. It looks to be a uh, probably like mid-stage Aerodynic. It's synchronized gears. Haven't really done much to it. I just know that I gave myself a hernia because there's a speaker in here and this thing's heavier than all get out. But my job initially now is to give it an evaluation, uh, find some domes for it because he wants domes. He wants red and blue, but these things have alley, or this has alley lights on it. If you get real close, you can kind of tell. Plus there's some damage. You can see the crack on that lens. The only thing I've done to it at this point is just giving it a bath. It's been in my backyard, uh, back of my project pile, well, not really backyard, but been the shed for probably about four months now. Uh, he brought this to me sometime in October and uh, I finally told him he's got to get off his butt because Federal is discontinuing these uh, aerodomes and I gave him kind of a price on what I'm seeing and it scared him. So now I'm waiting for him to get back to me and let me know what's going on. So I'm just giving you the quick 360. Uh, I'm going to try to get this off. Uh, I already took the screws out. You can see on the sides. I was kind of worried that the screws weren't going to come out. Sometimes they kind of seize themselves and you got to play with it. But now the domes are uh, fighting me. So let me see if I can get these domes off. Um, see what kind of bar this is. And uh, just for documentation purposes, so I know where I'm starting. Um, his plan ultimately is to replace these domes with new domes. And uh, I guess it's going to be some expensive expensive domes right now because federal just keeps raising prices before they just continue them but let's go ahead and take a look and uh, see if i can get these domes off i'll be back and we're back so a little bit of persuasion i got these domes off that was a bit of a fight uh probably one of the bigger fights i've had in a while nothing uh a dead blow mallet and some persuasion tools wouldn't uh, fix but uh as you can see the domes are off there they are so giving a look over, it's a little dirty. Again, this has been outside for a while. That's kind of interesting. So we've got an internal flasher on this bar. So this bar was set up with an internal flasher. Don't know if he's going to keep that. He might. It doesn't really matter. On uh, the grand scheme of things, he just wants this working and cleaned up. So this side doesn't look too bad. Um, just giving it a once over. Eh, it's going to need a wiring harness, but that's not a big deal. I can find that. Looks it needs to be cleaned up. I mean halogen so that's fine i'm missing a screw here in the middle i can find that that's not a big deal the next thing i usually look at is here on the bottom and we've got our where's my finger one two and three so that's there coming across to the this would be the passenger side right am i getting it reversed nope yeah i'm right so passenger side front looks okay nothing jumping out at me um obviously alleys motor Let's look at the tag and see if we can establish a date on this so we've got a 24 eah series a1h so this is the end of the uh the series there for the a1s h is probably the most common one that i encounter um i don't even know if i've ever seen anything higher on the series revision than an H. I think H has always been the highest. I've never seen an I or a J. I might be wrong. Somebody else comes across that. Let me know. Uh, and on the motor, is there a date on there? I can't tell. Very faintly, I see 87. I don't know if you guys can see that. Maybe. It's like right, right underneath type one. Let me hold that steady. 87. All right, so an 87 bar, no big deal. It's cold, my camera's acting up. Let's take a look here on the bottom. I've got one, two, and three. That's good, that means they're not broken off. The back side of the bar, dirty, needs to be cleaned up. And the internal flasher, and what looks to be a blown, or is that not blown? No, it's blown. Blown rear-facing uh, end lamp. Interesting. Uh, I'm not sure if the other ones are blown or not. I'd have to test them. 
but we'll have to go back through that. But that's it in a nutshell. I'm not going to sit here and power this one up today because that's not my objective. My objective on this one was just to take a look at it. What's the SAE tag on this? What, what do we got on here? Well, the SAE tag matches the motor tag, which means this bar is from 1987. Interesting. Uh, all in all, it appears to be in fairly good shape. I mean, I'm not seeing anything jumping out at me other than some dirt that needs to be addressed. There is a speaker in here. What speaker's in here? I don't know. Maybe we can cheat and take a look together. Let's see. Can I see it? Can you see it? I don't know. I may have to come back to that one or shine some light in there at some point. But there's definitely a speaker in there because this thing needs to go on a diet. <laughs> but that's it in a nutshell. I'm not, like I said, I'm going to keep this one simple because this is mostly just a quick overview of what I'm looking at and what I'm going to be working on next. So the next plans for me are, yay, um, I need inserts. I think I have a red insert for Ali, but I need to get a blue one. So I'm going to start inquiring the people who have them and... It's probably going to cost me an arm and a leg, but I'm going to go for it. B, uh, I'm going to definitely need a power cable, um, but even beyond the power cable, C, I'm going to need domes. And those are definitely going to cost me an arm and a leg. So I'm safe at this point that I think we're just going to do red, blue like we had before. And uh, I think I'm going to put some clear, uh, clear end caps on them because he's got alleys. So we're just going to do a red, blue with clear end caps. I think that's what we're going to go with, but... In a nutshell, that's it. So, uh, happy uh, New Year, belated. Uh, we are rolling up on Super Bowl Sunday here. This may actually go live on Super Bowl Sunday. Depends on when I can get back to the computer and do some editing. But uh, for all of you out there in uh, the Internet, hope everything's doing well. And uh, while I might be in PA, um, I'm not exactly rooting for the Eagles. So, uh, <laughs> for those of you out there that are football fans... You know what? I don't really care, but uh, I'm not a big Eagles fan, so that's about as political as I'm going to get on this channel. But anyway, you guys have a good weekend, and uh, I'll update this further when we uh, come back and I have some additional information. Have a good day.